what's up guys and girls this is naftastic rodney you know me and i have the uh the video pulled up here this is this is the giveaway video and then i have the youtube comment picker i was going to do a randomized lotto pick out of a hat or a bowl and, and just draw names that way but this makes it more uh, friendly I guess so if I read the comment and I don't think it's appropriate or not much thought put into it I will have the option to pick another one so with that being said I hope there's understanding basically if you if the comment says yeah I like hamburgers with pickles you know that's not going to be a good enough comment so with that being said let's get into this we have four prizes try to make this quick and sweet um, I'm not going to show the prize packs I have here y'all can go back to the proof to the video that's in question to see what you win for prize pack one two three or runner-up four I'm going to pick this in order that they were shown one two three and four so first pick is for four one second pick is for two third pick is for three fourth pick is for runner up the prizes will be uh we'll have 48 hour we'll make it easier we'll have 72 hours to get in touch with me um i'll leave contact information in the description Look in the description for your contact info to contact me, and I'll verify that it is the commenter that wins. And I get your shipping info, and I'll get these mailed to you within the week. That being said, let's get into this. I'm going to take a sip of drink. I want to say, first and foremost, thank you so much. I have very many good comments and this will help me make better content even though I'm thinking about changing a lot of things here um, but that's a whole other story so let's get into this I have already copy and pasted the video into the YouTube filter thing here I'm going to scroll down here filter duplicate users yes I'm not doing no replies to comments because all I did was give hearts I didn't use no specific text I'm not excluding any users or blacklisting and I'm not adding any extras so let's give it just a second we'll refresh this hey, let's see I'm not now that'll close it out. Get this work down here. Get YouTube comments. One hundred and sixty six comments. Okay. One hundred and sixty six comments. let's get down here and click on start winner winner chicken dinner Kelly O'Neill I dislike a salesman but prefer an impartial buyers advisor thank you Well, congratulations, Kelly O'Neill. Shows that it's the date, total names. I don't do this a whole lot, y'all. So all you have to forgive me. I'm making sure I'm doing everything right because I don't want any craziness. It shows that the date's time is 626, 1525. All right, now pick another winner. Nine 
John Scarborough. <laughs> yeah, now that's my buddy. I'm glad he won something. He, I, he uh, he's he's the one who sent in a knife for a donation. So he's good, definitely got to look a good chance of winning something because he just won mine. Probably my biggest issue with reviewers is those that push out so much content that they can't keep up with it. I really have to cut back on those I follow because of that reason. Congratulations on the milestone, and thanks to you and other contributors for the giveaway. And I believe I have your address because you just sent me a knife. How awesome is that? So you get prize pack number two. Let's pick another winner. Andrew Drill. Don't recognize the name, but congratulations, Andrew. What I like is an honest review, and what I hate is not doing enough close-up view of the subject in question. Okay. I agree with you. I like an honest review. I do not like a basher. I do not like someone who just bashes and nitpicks a knife for no reason. There's plenty of guys out there that do that. I do like an honest review that gives the facts the way they are. Thank you for your comment, Andrew. So that is number three. All right, so we got one, two, and three. You win the third prize pack. Let's go to the fourth runner up, pick another winner. Rick Karens, regular commenter. I love it when my commenters, so I've had two that I've recognized win. This is freaking awesome. I love it when guys who regularly comment on the channel win. That means a lot to me. And both John and Rick comment regularly. He says, I like it when the reviewer shows a knife without a bunch of size comparisons. I really like a reviewer that will deliberately pick a knife they are unsure of themselves, and if it isn't good, say so. I think every reviewer should do at least one video like that a quarter. If we all hear about how a good knife is and the company is fantastic, that can lead to some bad purchases. If a knife is bad, say so. Just don't return it to the company and, and us end users never know it should be avoided. Congrats on 750 subs. All the best to you and your family. All right, guys, this is quick and short. I think I might have Rick's information. I'm not sure. Um, but congrats to Kelly, to John, to Andrew, and to Rick. I hope y'all have enjoyed my channel as of far. I'm up to 144 subs now, I believe, which is awesome. I got almost 100 subs addition to this. So y'all please stay tuned for further reviews and further mods and shows and tales and all the stuff. And I will be doing a few things differently. I'm going to try to get back to a daily carry vid, which will be done with uh, the, the, what do you call it, the, the shorts. So where literally I show a knife for like 15 seconds what I got in pocket. I'm going to try to do one of those every day. It's basically not a review. It's nothing but just showing you what I got in my pocket. And then maybe one or two reviews a week if I can. Or maybe a detailed mod show and tell review. A week. One a week. And that's going to be about my limit. Um, I am changing things around. And I have a huge, huge, naftastic knife sale coming up. So y'all... Stay tuned for that. Please watch the videos. I'm going to have a lot of various knives, mainly two sons to begin with, 30 or 42 sons, some older models that are hard to find. I'm not selling it because I need to, or I don't, I don't, I'm doing it just, I'm changing some stuff around and I'm just getting rid of some inventory because I have too much inventory. <laughs> That being said, thank you again, everyone, for subscribing and commenting and stopping by to check my channel out. I really appreciate it. I hope y'all have a blessed day. And remember, I love you guys, and Jesus does too. This is Rodney, Naftastic EDC. God bless. 
Y'all take care. Bye now. Hey guys, I just thought of something. What if these some of these guys don't contact me? I know Rick will and I know uh, John will, but just in case, <laughs> I wasn't thinking about it. You can see I still have Rick's name up there from the last name I pulled. Just in case somebody doesn't claim a prize, I need to, I reckon, pick two um, extras as backups. So we're going to do that in this video, and this will be attached to the end of the video that I just did, because I'm not a YouTube guru, guys. I'm, I don't do this all the time, so forgive me. So when you see me saying bye, don't leave yet, because this is coming. <laughs> of course, you don't know that, because... You're not watching it yet, and I'm hitting the camera again. So let's let's scroll down here and pick another winner. We'll pick two more as backups. Oop. Rhino 54. <laughs> wow, buddy. Man, we got some good guys getting picked today. Man, I man, I I I want you to win because you're an awesome dude too. Even though you might cost more because it's international, but I don't care. Hello, Rodney. First of all, fantastic giveaway. I like reviews that give the facts, but with humor and stay light. Nothing too serious. It is, after all, just a hobby and should bring pleasure and information, not discontent. Everyone may have different views, and that is normal, but knives are knives, be they traditional or modern, budget or high-end, and I enjoy them all without discrimination. I too don't like cussing and aggressively on channels, aggressivity on channels which seem to thrive on hitting on inferior knives or steels that, and even other channels. Another thing I dislike enormously is the reviewers who hate on something before using or seeing it because of its provenance. I agree with you there, brother. Chinese or overseas manufacturers, therefore inferior, made in the USA, therefore superior. This has been proven wrong so many times that it's just annoying now. That said, I admire patriotism wherever you are from. Another thing I dislike is torture testing life to failure and therefore proving it inferiority. I have seen channels batoning small EDC knives and when the lock inevitably fails, saying the knife is badly made. Hit hard enough, anything will break. You don't use a carrot to hammer in a nail. <laughs> LOL. One last thing, this time not the channels, but the subscribers. If you don't like the channel, don't subscribe. Simple as that. There are many who sub just to moan about the same thing over and over. Sorry, Rodney, a bit long. You know, I am not often negative, but you asked all the best. So true, my friend Rhino, my buddy Don. Very, very true. Well said by a true knife enthusiast. I appreciate your assertions of a knife channel and subscriber. I really appreciate it. All right, let's pick one more as backup. And then I will end this video for good this time. All right, so pick another winner. All right. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? C. Lemansky. Another commenter that's normal. I'll tell you, I'm, I'm glad to see you. I'm, I'm getting commenters that I know that are regulars on my channel. Again, this is just a backup, but maybe if some other people don't claim, you will get it. Thank you so much for entering. Congratulations, I like shorter reviews. Don't need to sit through 18 minutes of the reviewer reading off the specs that anyone can quickly find online anyway. Very, very true. All right, guys, this is it. That's two backups. So, Again, thank you so much for entering my giveaway, and I hope everyone enjoys their prizes. And again, the comments were very well accepted, and I appreciate all the thought process that went into them and the effort y'all gave forth. And my details will be in the description for you to contact me and send me your info so I can get these prize packs out to you. Again, thank you so much. This is Rodney, Naftastic EDC, you know me, formerly 
Garacor EDC. For any of y'all that don't remember, I used to be Garacor. Now I'm Naftastic. All right, y'all. God bless. Bye now.